While the government may have done some good, on balance it has done far more harm. Dr. Prabhagar slams the Modi government in its catastrophic economical running of the country. Finance Minister Nirmala Sidharaman's husband, economist Dr. Prabhagar, during his candid interview with Karan Tapar about his new book, The Cricket Timber of New India, took the opportunity to criticize the means in which the Modi government is running India. The book is a collection of essays surrounding Modi's government, and he was assertive that it will be disastrous if Modi's government continues to take on the country in 2024. Dr. Prabhagar mentioned that he, Modi, is staggeringly incompetent in economics and most things except summoning divisive communal instincts that are way buried deep inside the social psyche of India. Dr. Prabhagar does not shy away from his deep-rooted belief that it was not the economical development of the country that BJB prioritised, but in fact their interest lay in promoting Hindutva. The author recalled that BJP swore secularism till even 10 years ago, but now the party advocates for Hindutva through their actions and words. So why does Dr. Prabhagar have such visceral contempt for the Modi regime? Let's look back on some of the major downfalls that possibly could have led the author to have this opinion. Modi was able to lay the foundation of his government in India by offering grand promises. However, was he able to live up to it? He bravely took on an already underperforming economy. Was he able to transform it? The currency ban in 2016, GSD and lockdowns has only worsened job opportunities and our youth are running away from a country that gives them no hope for the future. India's GDP at a high of 78% when Modi took office had fallen to its lowest in a decade, 3.1% by the fourth quarter of the years 2019 to 2020. Healthcare has appallingly been neglected and our farmers are in no better condition with many, although feeding the country, are unable to feed their own families. However, when asked about his own wife's handling of the Indian economy as our finance minister, he responded that he had no interest in speaking about individuals and that he was only criticizing Modi as it is the Modi government that is ruling India. Nonetheless, it is not right to say that there has been no progress made since Modi entered India's political stage. We have become a business rival for China with manufacturing 19% of all smartphones. Yet Dr. Prabhagar dismisses this, stating that these are meaningless parts of the economy. After recently being hit hard with a defeat in Karnataka, BJP is once more trodden down upon.